Hey, it's Eric Dishman here. I'm in Bethesda this week, uh, lovely Maryland. Uh, it's the middle of June somehow already, but I just wanted to give you an update over the last week or so. Um, the big news is 100 participants have joined the All of Us Research Program. Uh, it's a long way to go to a million, but they're giving us great feedback on bugs that need to be fixed, ways to sort of present things in a better way. Um, just incredibly you know, appreciative of these 100 pioneers suffering through a system that needs to improve and giving us great feedback to do that. Um, we've got uh, Pittsburgh still starting to ramp up its participants, as well as Henry Ford in Detroit came on this week. So they're starting small and then they grow bigger over time as well. So great to have them in the fold. Uh, next week there'll be several that I'll talk about once it goes successfully. Um, we had a consortium face-to-face, -face. so over 100 people came from all over the country from our different partners, academic, technology, marketing partners. And really, it's, there's nothing like spending time together in spite of all the email and video conferencing we do with each other. And we really were focusing on the first day, getting a lot of the other sites who are ready to go um, to get really practical knowledge from Pittsburgh and Henry Ford about the whole process they needed to go to say, yep, you're go for a beta launch. And then the second day, we really started looking at what's next. Um, we spent some time thinking about, um, okay, the tools and the policies we need in place for researchers and it was really great to have the perspective of, of two of our participant representatives there, um, Carl Sherkin and Steve Makita. Um, in fact, I shot some video dialogue with them that we'll share with you soon. Um, just brought great narratives, great perspectives on um, what they hope for the program and what motivates them to be here, and, and then giving us advice throughout the entire week um, on the things that are the, the two-day face-to-face. And, and with regards to researchers, we're aiming right now for launching what would be called our researcher portal probably early mid-summer of next year, 2018. We need to collect uh, a lot of data first um, and then start building and testing out those tools, but there's great progress. Many of them have already been prototyped um, and experimenting with interfaces to make it incredibly easy for a wide range of researchers to at that point be able to access uh, de-identified electronic health record data, um, survey data, as well as that point we should have a bunch of the geographic data that tells us things about where people have lived and be able to give some of that information back to people. So I'll give you an update next week, three sites starting, fingers crossed it all goes well, but it's early days and continue to look for your suggestions and your improvement.